for only half feet. Yeah, yeah. You know, you know that's in Walmart right now, right? Yeah. 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 Let's get ready. Let's yeah. Get ready. Yeah. Yeah. Obamacare, yeah. right? You want to read? Yeah. 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 That's right. Yeah. 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 Yeah, right. this, this is um, this is Revelations 13 and 15, and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, and that the image of the beast should speak and causes as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Verse 16, and he causes all, both small and great, free, I mean, small and great, rich and poor, free and bun, to receive a mark in their in their right hand. Or in their foreheads, that in in that no man might buy or sell, save he that have the mark. Yeah. Now, forgive me. I said it's gonna happen before 2017. I hope it do. We Lord willing to do, but it's gonna happen soon. It's gonna happen. Period. Mm -hmm. And that's talking about this right here. Now, no this pictures, ain't something no that's pictures, not out please. yet. Thank you. You had a, a family in Boca Raton. They, they had on the news where they took this chuck over there in Sweden. They already taking it, using it again inside their own buildings. Louisiana. So. They got it available, and probably a lot of rich upper people got it. And but pretty soon they're gonna start pushing it when this money fall, because it's gonna fall. And that's gonna be the hour of temptation. And um, Lord said, if you take that, that's it for you, man. The hour of temptation that should come upon the whole world. That's right. Like you had the, the Great Depression in 1939. You had different famines, but the Lord said these times are gonna be the worst of all times. That's why it's important to get this knowledge, man. Because Isaiah 33 and 6 says, Wisdom, knowledge and wisdom shall be the stability of thy times. But knowledge of what? Knowing that you're an Israelite and knowledge of the Lord, knowing that he doesn't look like a um, Razan. Flip, um, flip the sign. Knowing that's, that's not him. That's not scripture. That's an idol. Yeah, so, that was created by uh, a famous... Uh, Famous artist. That's yeah, Michelangelo, Michelangelo and, uh, and Leonardo, Leonardo, Leonardo da Vinci. Yeah. yeah. Rodrigo um, Borgia, um, Borgia right. also the known as Pope Alexander. The fire eyes. Uh, you guys uh, forgot uh, the text. Uh, yeah, Rodrigo was Pope Alexander the Sixth. Pope Alexander the Sixth set up his son Caesar Borgia. He has a writing on this. A writing on this. On this. I'm not familiar with that, but they do have a show that comes on Showtime called The Borgias, and that was a family who did this. And since then, show 9 and 24, somebody, real quick, since then the, wor the world has been worshiping this. And don't, don't the scripture say the whole world shall be deceived? You shall deceive the whole world? And that's exactly what happened. I gotta run out of here, man. Okay. So thank you for your time. I got your card. All right. Read the website on that, and it's the website on that card. We on YouTube, GMS. Hey, man. This is Job 9 and 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof, if not where and who is he. This is Job 9 and 24. The earth is given unto the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. Con, man, the Lord said that, that the earth is given into the hand of the wicked, man. And who, who are the people who are ruling the planet Earth? Because we read earlier that the Most High give it, give, um, give it the, the Most High ruleth, ruleth in the kingdom of men, and He giveth it to the basis of men, man. He said it to whom He will. So um, the Most High gave the kingdom to the so-called white man right now, man. So that proves that He's the wicked, man. Because he's ruling the earth right now. Go ahead. The earth is given to the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? Con, man. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. How did he, how did he do that? He did that with the image of Cesare Borgia, man. By, pay, by painting the Lord as, as a, the son of a pope who was a pedophile, who was an idolater, and who was a fucking um, incest motherfucker, man. That's right. Who was a fucking homosexual. And, a, and, a, and he has leprosy too, man, which is a curse from God. 
So the scripture say, if not, if, if if it's not Esau, then where and who is he, man? If Esau is not the wicked, then who the fuck is the devil, man? I mean, obviously, like, like to say, like, if it was if it was Moab, you know, Moab would have made sure he had slanty eyes with that little um uh, uh pencil pencil beard going on and shit. So you know, you know, I got a precept though. This is Hosea four and one. Hear the word of the Lord, the children of Israel. For the Lord hath a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. Which land is he talking about, man? The land of Babylon, man. The land of confusion. All right, spiritual, spiritual Egypt, spiritual Babylon, spiritual Sodom and Gomorrah, which is America, man. And the Lord is about to explain why he has a problem with you people, man. Because there is no truth no mercy, no knowledge of the most high in this land. Yeah, like we was getting into it. There's no truth in this land, man. Everything everything America stands on is a lie. Right. right. Everything you see in, in America is a mirage. It's a lie, man. All right? If there's no mercy here. They're, they're, uh, 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 these motherfucking Edomites, these these police, they'll take they they'll take a Jake for crossing the street, bash him in his head with a, with a billy club, Throw a sack of drugs on him and say he was serving drugs, but the drug dealer over there on the corner getting treated like a boss, man, like a king. Ain't no mercy here, man. All right, and it says, um, and nor no, nor knowledge of the Most High in this land because the people still call the Most. Yeah, yeah, acknowledge the Most High as the Jehovah, man. Yeah, acknowledge His Son as Jesus Christ. Like who is that? Yeah, yeah, worship Chesare Borshir, man. Yeah, yeah, I think uh, 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 Edomite, a faggot, a, a feeble faggot, man, who committed incest with his own fucking sister, is your Lord and Savior, man. That's why Yahweh Bashim has a problem with this place, man. If I could say, they think that, they think that uh, God loves everybody, man. Huh. They think that the Lord's coming back to save everyone, man. They think the law is done, done away with. They think it's okay to be a, a homosexual, man. They think, they think that God is all love and all good. But the scriptures have some harsh and bitter things in them, man. The Lord said that he create evil. That's right. right. That's right. By swearing and lying and killing and stealing and committing adultery, they break out and blood touches blood. Therefore shall the land mourn, and everyone that dwelleth therein shall languish with the beasts of the, of the field and with the fowls of heaven. Yea, the fishes of the sea also shall be taken away, man. America's gonna get annihilated. Point blank, period. America's gonna get new. Ain't gonna be no America, man. It's gonna be a, a big desert wasteland, man. That's right. Second Peter chapter 3, verse um, 8. But beloved, be not ignorant of this one thing, that one day is with the Lord as a thousand years, and a thousand years as one day. So the things that Esau did, slavery and, and uh, the Middle Passage getting Jake over here and the uh, conquistadors doing what they doing in the, um, the Northern Kingdom, even though Esau be like, oh, that was long ago to the Lord, that's, that was uh, less than a day ago. So the, they punishment still, they verdict, the verdict is already done. They punishment still coming for that. Verse 9. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise. Which which what's part of that promise? That vengeance that's gonna come upon um Esau. That's gonna come upon our enemies. The Lord's enemies. As some men count slackness, but as long suffering to us were not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. And that's talking about the elect. That's right. Verse 10. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in the which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat, the earth also in the works that are therein shall be burnt up. Destruction. That's all it's talking about, destruction. That has to come. That's surely to come. You can't, you can't um, misconstrue that. You can't misinterpret that. Verse 11. Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of persons ought you to be in all holy conversation and godliness? That's why we out here. Because we out here doing what we supposed to do and to exhort others to do what they supposed to do that's um, part of the nation of Israel. 
but we only out here trying to fish the elect. But we telling all the Israelites that what they supposed to be doing to get the blood off our hands. That's right. That they supposed to be watching, that the Lord is about to come. Follow the commandments. Stop being a nigga. Stop being a heathen. The water. Yeah, man. What man of persons ought you to be? Wishing for the downfall of um, the so-called white man, because he wicked as hell. Second Corinthians chapter 13, verse 5. Examine yourselves, whether ye be in the faith. Prove your, prove your own selves. Know ye not your own selves? How that Yahweh Shahamashiach is in you, except ye be reprobates? Yeah, basically, you know, reiterating what the brother said, man. What man of conversation you should be in, man. Examining yourself daily, man, because you know the destruction that the most high gonna bring. That's right. This in, in the scripture saying in the rough, uh, rough, uh, rough, roundabout way, hey, if you ain't examining yourself, hey, you might just be a fucking reprobate, man. Well, man, the conversation ought you to be in conversation. That word in the Greek, I don't remember it, but basically in saying your manner of living. Right. In the scripture say, be in this truth, study, be brotherly, be in this thing in sincerity. Fellowship with brothers, because this 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 is what we have, and that's what the Lord told us to do. So if you ain't doing it, you ain't doing all that you can be doing to um, try to um, get your salvation. This is Ephesians five and fifteen. See that ye see that ye walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise. Redeeming the time because the days are evil. Wherefore ye not wherefore be not unwise, but understand that the will of understand what the will of the Lord is. So basically, man, like the brother said, you gotta be you gotta be in the spirit all the time. You gotta be with the brothers, with the brotherhood of uh, redeeming the time, because the, the time that is coming is gonna be evil, man. So right. we, the only thing we got is ourselves in the scriptures and the apostles that teach us from GMS. You know, and the Lord, the Spirit, how about you, my shot? Come, right. This is the time to be doing those things, to examine ourselves. Because once the ball, once the shit drop, once the once shit hit the, start hitting the fan, for real, for real, it's over with. The, you you better have the Lord then. Now is the time to, to um, fight off them demons. That That's um, that's holding you back from, from doing what you're supposed to do. Uh, this is... This is Romans chapter 12, verse 1. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable unto the Most High, which is your reasonable service. Okay. Yeah, so we don't belong to ourselves no more. We are living sacrifices. We are the Lord's. We, sacri we, we sacrifice our time. Everything revolves around coming out here on Saturday. We make sure we be able to come out here on Saturdays. If brothers fellowshipping, hey, we gonna, we gonna try our best, if we can make it, to fellowship with brothers, to be in the spirit. We are living sacrifices, man. We get, you ought to be, so you can have, that shows faith. Go ahead. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good an acceptable and perfect will of the Most High. God, so the scriptures say, the scriptures say that not only is this your, your reasonable service, but the scriptures say that you're not supposed to be conformed to the ways of this world, man. You're not supposed to be lusting after the, the things that these people lust after, man. But you have to be uh, transformed by the by the renewing of your mind, man. You got to be washed by the water of the Word, man. You got to be born again so you can prove, so you can discern what is good and acceptable unto the Most High, man. Because none of this shit out here that these people desire out, out here, man, none of that shit is, is good and acceptable to the Most High, man. The Lord, the Lord requires sacrifice, man. The Lord requires uh, mourning. The Lord, the Lord requires lamentation. The Lord requires supplication, man. The Lord re requires dedication. The Lord requires faith and fear and reverence in Him. As it is written, you're supposed to work out your own salvation with fear and trembling, man. Right. Uh, if you, if you, if you want. 
this inheritance that's coming if you want to be saved with them chariots. Because if you confirm to this world, if you're worried about this world, if the world is stopping you from doing what you're supposed to do, that show a lack of understanding. Because this world is about to be over in a minute. This is James 4 and 4. Ye adulterers and adulteresses, know ye not that the friendship of the world is enemy with Yahweh? Ah, the friendship of the world is enmity with the Most High. That's being against the Most High. Whosoever, whosoever therefore would be a friend of the world is the enemy, is the enemy of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. That's right. right. Point blank, period. Hey. I was gonna say that's why um uh, King Daniel and uh, um and King David, that's a King Daniel. King David slide. King David said it in Psalms, man, he has a perpetual hatred for those that hate thee, man. So so uh uh if you're an enemy against this truth, you're an enemy in most, uh, against the Most High, we have a perpetual hatred for you, man. That means you hate the Most High, man. A perfect hatred for you. Yeah, that's, blood, that's blood in, blood out, whether you family or not. We got that's perpetual right. hatred for you, just like the Most High. The scriptures say, be like your Father which is in heaven. He hate those that hate him, so we hate those that hate him. Right. Plain and simple. That's why they don't see us around, why right. they used to see us. Exactly. This is um, uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 2, uh, verse 13. Which things also we speak, not in the words which man's wisdom teacheth, but which the Holy Ghost teacheth, comparing spiritual things with spiritual. Verse 14. But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of the Most High, for they are foolishness unto him. Neither can he know them, because they are spiritually discerned. Yeah, the things of this truth, the things of the Most High, the Most High's judgments are spiritually discerned. So if you're not spiritual, you ain't going to see it. You ain't going to feel it. You can't be in this truth in sincerity if, if, if you ain't got that spirit upon you to do it. The Lord ain't put the spirit on you to discern it. Bottom line. And that's what it all boils down to. The Lord putting the spirit on you to do, do, to do things. To, to either uh, do his will or to do wicked. Anybody else got something to say? You got nothing? Good. For sure. And with that, we give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Um, double honors to apostles and elders, a great millstone. Salutation, love to all you brothers out there spreading the word in truth and sincerity. And on three, Death to America. One, two, three. Death, Death to America! America. So no.